This mod review is brought to you by the Farmer Klein YouTube channel. Please like, subscribe, and comment. So today, guys, I've got a mod for you. It's called Cattle Breeds. Uh, basically, it goes and provides a little bit of meaning as to why you would want to pick different colored cows. Uh, base game, of course, we have several different types of cows we can pick from, but they all pretty much do the same thing. So we can go how now brown cow, we can have a brown and white cow, a black cow, black and white, then we have Brahmin brown, white, light brown, and gray, and they pretty much do the same thing. So what we're going to do is we're going to get one regular cow, we'll go with the brown cow, just for funsies, and over here we're going to get one Brahmin, and then we're going to basically put water, food, and straw in and basically see how much of each resource this single cow takes and I believe the Brahmin and I believe the uh, brown cow the normal cow uh, basically gonna require the same amount of food same amount of water and the same amount of straw and I think they're gonna reproduce or they're gonna produce the same amount of manure, slurry, and milk. Go ahead and put this in there. All right. Go ahead and give the Brahmin some. All right. And the reason we're doing this is I want to establish a baseline as to what the base game requirements are per animal. Because the cattle breeds mod basically goes in and adjusts the amount that, uh, that each specific cow type requires. Uh, it also then changes what each specific cow type produces. So some cows produce more milk. Some cows produce no milk. Some cows produce a lot more manure uh, than other cows, etc. So we need to establish the baseline. Then once we have our established baseline, we're going to go ahead and re-fire up the game activate the cattle breeds mod and uh, basically do the same thing we're going to buy one of each unique cattle breed we're going to uh, fill the troughs up with total mixed rations straw and water we're not going to mess with hay or grass and then we're going to advance 24 hours and just see what each specific breed um, basically produces. So give me another few moments. We'll have our baseline. Okay, so you can see here. Uh, we need to get rid of those cows, don't we? That was from the uh, that was from the DLC video. All right, so you can see here from the one brown cow, we need 800 liters of water, 950 liters of straw, and 3,500 liters of mixed rations. Brahmins, 800, 950, and 3,500. Now what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and I'm going to make a notation of that information so that I will have it handy because I will likely forget it. So the default um, cow values are um, water, 800 liters. Straw is 950. 
and TMR is 3,500. Okay, so what we're going to do is we are now going to fast forward 24 hours and see just what these cows produced. Let me go ahead and the way we're going to do this, we're going to fast forward until 8 p.m., We're going to jump over here to our farmhouse. And we're going to go inside and we're going to sleep for 12 hours. Which should pull up um, 8 p.m. 8 a.m. Okay, now we're going to come back here. And we're going to fast forward two more hours to get us to 10 Okay, that is about where we were yesterday, and let's take a look. So our one cow has produced 197 liters of manure, 247 liters of slurry, and 145 liters of milk. The Brahmin has produced the exact same amount. So let's write those default values down um, after 24-hour uh, production. Okay, let's look at the reproduction rate. The reproduction rate is 1,249, basically 1,249 hours. Okay, the manure is 197 liters. The slurry is 247, and the milk is 145. Okay, so what we're going to do now that we have these baseline values, we're going to reset and we're going to come back and basically we're going to buy one of each specific breed of cow that is included in the cattle breeds mod. So don't blink, we'll be right back. Welcome back guys, it is as if we just left, isn't it? Well, at any rate, what we're going to do is we're going to go ahead and pick up one of each unique cow type and while we're doing that I will basically talk to you a little bit about the cattle breeds mod okay so in this one we're going to get a red whole cow and one thing you can see is the purchase values of the cows are now different this also means that the um, sell prices of the cows are also going to be different Look at that. It was $2,700 to buy it and $1,300 to deliver. Holy cow's ears. <laughs> uh, now, let's go ahead and take a look at the next one. Next breed is Ashire. Now, some of these breeds I've never heard of before. I'm not well versed in cattle. So, Ashire's $3,300 to purchase. $1,300 delivery fee. Yeah, we got an Ashire cow. Let's head on down here. Now this cattle breeds mod, uh, I am looking at version 1.1, 1 .1, uh, but in the first iteration, it was uh, some attribution was given to the mod author that did another mod uh, that basically this mod author took that work and basically enhanced it, and that was the animal species mod. So we have Basically, Black Angus, $5,200 to purchase. The same $1,300 delivery charge. And what that animal species mod did was it basically allowed you to purchase, let's say, like one cow, but it, it basically produced the equivalent of 10 cows. Or you could buy one cow and it did 100 cows worth of production. But it also ate 100 cows worth of requirements. So we have Holstein, $3,900. $1,300 again to get a delivery. And then we should have one more. And that is basically all the Brahmins are the same. We're going to go with the Brown Brahmin, $2,700. $1,300 delivery charge. $4,000 total dollars to get our ramen. So now we basically have one of each breed. 
And what I'm going to do is I'm going to basically read to you out of the Lewis script how these are going to basically, what the requirements, I should say, are for each breed above and beyond the, um, the normal specifications of the animals. Let me get that pulled up for you. So first up, we're going to look at the red pole, okay? So the red pole do not produce any milk. So you, we won't be getting any milk out of these. Uh, they produce two and a half times, or I guess I should say one and a half times the manure that a normal cow uh, in base game would produce. They produce 50% more slurry. They require 80% more food. They require the same amount of water and the same amount of straw. And when we go to sell those, we're going to be able to sell them for $1,450. So if you remember, they pr the purchase price on the red pole was $2,700. And the birth rate has been adjusted. Uh, the birth rate is basically 80% um, increased. They will reproduce faster than uh, than the default M-game cows. And then we have the Ashire cows. The Ashire are the brown and white cows. And the way the Ashire cows work is they produce 80% more milk than the base game. They produce 20% more manure, 20% more slurry. They require 40% more food, same amount of water, the same amount of straw. And if you remember, we purchased them for $3,300 and they sell for $850. And they have their birth rate is basically the same as in game. Now we've got the Angus. So the Angus cows are basically beef cattle, just like the Red Pole. The Angus cows do not produce any meat or any milk. Let's see, I think that is all of them. Let's just check. So, oh, we need the Brahmin. I missed the Brahmin. Oh, yeah, Brahmin, 5,200 liters. Holstein, 5,950 liters. The Angus, 6,300 liters. Ashire, 40. Well, it's probably 4,900. The Red Pole, 6,300. And there you go. So remember, the default value for one cow for total mixed rations was 3,500. See how these are comparing to the default for total mixed rations. Okay, let's go ahead and get the water and we'll continue on talking about the Angus. So again, the Angus cows do not produce any milk. They produce one and a half times the manure, just like the Red Pole. They produce 50% more slurry and they produce, um, well, they eat 80% more. Sorry about that. They drink the same amount of water and the same amount of straw as required. Uh, purchase price, if you remember, is $5,200. Now, we can sell the Angus cows for $2,800. They have a pretty good retail value or resale value, and that is because they don't have the ability to do milk. So that is their only value, is the uh, is reproduction. And speaking of reproduction, they reproduce 80% faster than the in-game cows. So let's go ahead then and talk about the Holstein cattle. So the Holstein cattle are basically milkers. They produce one and a half times more milk than the in-game cattle. They produce 20% more manure, 
20% more liquid manure. Make sure I don't drive off the edge there. Uh, they produce they require 70% more food than the in-game cows the same water the same straw and they were $3,900 to buy and they really don't have much resale value they are only $975 to sell and they breed at the same rate as the in-game cows now all of the Brahmin are the same Let's go ahead and just take a look at the one Brahmin color. That would be the, the brown. So the Brahmin uh, do not produce any milk. They are beef only. They produce 50% more manure than base. 1.5% or 150% more liquid manure. They require 50% more food. And they require 80% more water, same amount of straw, that uh, you can buy them for $2,700 and you can sell them, get this, for $1,500. And they reproduce 60% faster than base game cows. So while we're filling that up with water, let's take a look at the straw requirements. So again, remember the base straw requirements was 950 liters. So the Brahmin was 950, Holstein 950, Angus 950, Ashire 950, and the Red Pole all are 950. So they all take the same amount of straw as do the base game. But we do know that at least some breeds maybe one breed specifically takes only takes a little bit more water so what I'm going to do is I'm going to go ahead and fill up all of these pens with water and I'll be right back all right guys we have got them all filled with water just going to move this tractor up here out of the way and let's go ahead and take a look and just see what they require so our Holsteins, oops, no, there's a Brahmin. Brahmin require 1,440 liters of water. Remember the base was 800 per cow. Holstein are 800. Water, Angus, Ashire, and Red Pole are all at 800. So what we're going to do is just like what we did at the start of the video, we're going to fast forward until 8 p.m. And then we're going to sleep for 12 hours. Go ahead and run on down here to the house. Sleep for 12 hours. And then we're going to fast forward two more hours till we are at 10 o'clock. There we go. Go ahead and fast forward till 10 o'clock. Right, that is about where we were. Uh, when we when we left and let's take a look and see how our cows have produced so the Brahmin we have reproduction rate of 781 hours remember these reproduce 60% faster than base game base game was 1249 hours uh, reproduction for one Brahmin cow is 781 we have 299 liters of manure. Remember the base game manure value after 24 hours was 1,971. Is that really, is that right? Oh no, 197. Sorry, I had an L on the end. That's the only one I had an L value written down for. So 197 liters. The Brahmin have 299. Slurry, they've got a lot of slurry, 624. Versus 247 is the base, remember? And no milk. So the Brahmin would be really good if you were looking to get a lot of slurry in order to fertilize fields. And you could then obviously sell them for more money. Holsteins. So Holsteins, remember, they are basically milkers. So they have the same general reproductive rate as base game. 
239 liters of manure, so they do a little bit more manure. 200 or 300 liters of slurry, a little bit more slurry, but look at that milk value. So remember, the base game was 145 liters of milk. Uh, we are at 363 liters for the Holstein over 24 hours. Angus. Remember, the Angus cows are beef cattle, just like the Brahmin. Reproduce. We're at 694 hours versus, again, 1,249. 500 liters, basically, of manure versus 197. They put out a lot of poo uh, compared to the Brahmin that put out a lot of slurry. So for slurry, the, the Angus put out a little bit more than base, but not near as much as manure. And again, they put out no milk. Let's take a look at the Ashire. So the Ashire cows, at least, I might be saying that wrong, I don't know. I'm not a, I'm not a cow person, okay? Reproduction, pretty much the same as base game. 239 liters of manure versus 197 again. 300 liters of slurry versus 247. Not a lot of difference there. 265 liters of milk versus 145 liters of milk. Or milkers, for sure. And then Red Pole. Red Pole are once again not milk cattle. They are beef cattle. Uh, they reproduce 694 hours for one cow versus 1249. 500 liters of manure versus 197 again. 375 liters of slurry versus 247. And no milk. And that is all based on total mixed rations, which is 100% effectiveness across all of cattle. Okay? So, guys, I hope you liked this video. If you did, please go ahead and click that like button. Let me know in the comments what do you think of the Cattle Breeds mod. Uh, you can find this mod over at modhub.us. I have included a link in the description below. And until next time, Happy farming.